everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a requested video which is on my daily hair routine. It's very simple and easy and quick so I'm going to also show you how I did this really quick, simple and messy hair bun for everyday looks. So I hope you enjoy it. I always make sure to towel dry my hair first so that it's about 60 to 70% dry before blow drying. This will limit the chances of split ends and damage to hair. Next I'm going to spray some heat protector, particularly focusing on the ends of the hair. Here I'm using this Tony and Guy heat defense spray. Then I'm going to use my John Frieda's conditioning treatment and spray this to the ends of my hair. Now it's time for blow drying. I'm using a very basic blow dryer that only has two settings and is only for the speed of the dryer rather than heat. But I would say that it is on a medium heat. Making sure your hair is completely dry after shower is very important to avoid getting headaches or catching a cold. Blow drying is an efficient and easy method of gaining more volume for your hair. Even with a quick blow dry, it can make your hair bouncy. I blow dry my hair in three directions. First, I pour as much hair as I can to my left and make sure the roots are dry, then moving on to the ends. Then I do the same thing when I pull my hair to my right and then gather them all to the front. As I dry my hair, I also use my fingers to comb through my hair to make sure the bottom layer is also exposed to the heat. Blow drying these three directions means I'm forcing my hair to be on the opposite ways to how I usually wear them and therefore when I style my hair in the position they are supposed to be in, the hair is lifted and volumised. So moving on to the messy bun, I'm going to gather my hair at the centre of the crown. Make sure that it isn't directly at the top of your head, unless that's where you prefer your bun to be. If you have any fallouts like I do, don't worry, we can clip them in later on. Now start twisting the hair to one side as tightly as you can until it starts to curl on its own. Then shape it in a bun and secure it with a hair tie. Loosen up the hair for a natural and messy look. Now we're going to take the fallouts and clip them either into the bun or just below the bun depending on personal preferences. Here I'm clipping it just under the bun with two bobby pins. until you are satisfied with the look. And now finish with some hairspray. I really hope you enjoyed it. I am going to do a, a makeup tutorial soon 
after my skin gets a little bit better it's at a very um, bad condition at the moment and I also will be doing some product reviews um, from Lush and uh, other acne treatment products. If you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you have any suggestions or any requests please comment um, down below and of course please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!